We will not allow them to fix the budget on the backs of us or our students. Don't bounce the budget on the back of teachers. That was the message of over 300 educators, paraprofessionals, and support staff, urging the Baltimore County School Board to find other ways to bridge an $80 million budget deficit. They became just the latest chapter in a wave of teacher protests sweeping the nation to demand better pay and working conditions. High school student Dorian Beverly said he came out to make sure his teachers got the pay they deserved. I feel like all the teachers really, they deserve their pay. And they, they, they are the key to our future. Y'all, what y'all don't know is there's no LeBron James, it ain't no Michael Jordans, it ain't no people you look up to without teachers. Allie Carter, a teacher at Dundalk Middle, said she had to leave the rally early to work her second job. We should not have teachers burning out and leaving at such quick rates because we're not paid enough as it is, even on the current scale we have. I actually have to leave in an hour to go work my second job because I can't pay my bills without it. Teacher Union President Abby Baton said teachers have been inspired by similar actions in other states. I think it finally uh, says to our folks, you know what, we do have to stand up in order to get what we need for our students. Because when I hear from my te the, the teachers in the schools, they come to me and they say, I can't, I don't have this, I can't do this. And to a teacher, they say to me, I can't do what's right for my kids. The county executive, a former teacher himself, has said teacher pay should not be cut. And the board emphasized the budget is not final. A final vote will be held on February 19th. For The Real News, this is Jessel Knorr in Towson, Maryland.